I've always liked the cold. Even when I was a kid, I used to go to school with no, no, no jacket on. They used to send me home, coming to school with no jacket. <laughs> As a lifelong resident of Brighton Beach in Brooklyn, Gary Atlas used to get a kick out of seeing the old, robust Russians in the neighborhood taking their chilly morning dips in the ocean. Something about it seemed to keep them happy and healthy, he thought. The water's about 38 degrees now, 38, 39 degrees. And it uh, goes down to about 34 maybe in another month or two, another six weeks by February. But uh, it's a pleasure out here. I haven't gotten sick since I started swimming every day. And the salt water is good for your skin. I also gargle with this. Salt water, if it, any bugs in here, any, any, any dirt in the water, if it doesn't kill you, it makes you stronger. On September 21st, 2007, he began a daily routine that included a six-mile run, always shirtless, along the beach and boardwalk from his oceanfront apartment building, past the famous Coney Island attractions, and back, after which he would strip down and take a nice swim in the ocean, whatever the weather, whatever the water temperature. Gary says he began his daily routine as a relief from his depression and emotional strain while unemployed and tending to his mother, who was dying from emphysema. Just to relieve the stress, because I was really breaking down mentally and physically, I, I needed to uh, just be out away from her for a while, for an hour. Enid passed away in 2009, but Gary has kept his routine going in her memory. Hey, it's a great feeling, man. What can I tell you? It's just nothing beats it. You know, it's like being on vacation for an hour. Afterwards, he drips dry and knocks around the boardwalk where he seems to know everyone, even the old Russian ladies with their fur coats and walkers. God bless him. I tell you one thing, I see him every day, middle of the winter. Last week, the blizzard in the water. So it's, it's an amazing thing. You know, his levels must be excellent. You know that? His levels got to be great. Do you, check your, do you check your levels often? I haven't been to a doctor in 35 years. All right. 37 years. Imagine that. That's why he's still with us. God bless you, kid. <laughs> 